Hey Tom, Bob McBeth here. Uh, couldn't make it down today. Just want to say hello and congratulations on your years of service at the college and coaching. Um, I know you've meant a lot to a lot of people there. I wish this was a kind of like a celebrity roast where we could just tell stories, but uh, we'll do that another time. Uh, I know a lot of us who played for you and went to school there, we still get together. We have fond memories of our time there and the, the conversation always turns back to the times at SWAC, and, and you were a big part of that. And so I just wanted to say thank you for those. And oh, hold on. Sorry. Got a phone call. Hello? It's Doug Miles at Marshfield. Hey, what's up? You're playing North Bend Tuesday night? Are they any good? Who's coaching them now? Oh, is that, is that that short guy that we played in 2011 at the state tournament? Oh, yeah, I, I, Doug, I, I don't think you have anything to worry about there. So, uh, yeah, I'll call you back later. I'm in the middle of a video. All right, bye. Anyway, sorry about that, Tom. But uh, you're a coach. You understand those things. Uh, so, anyway, uh, I hope you get back into coaching someday. Uh, I know you're good at it, and I know you're good with kids. And so uh, I just hope you enjoy uh, your day, and sorry I couldn't be there. Thanks. Hey, Tom. Just... Uh... Debbie asked me to uh, record a couple things since I can't make it to your banquet up here in Anchorage. Um, just want to thank you for a couple things. Uh, one of them is for coaching. I've been coaching for 20 years. I know how thankless I can be. Um, but uh, I'm sure you made a big impact on a lot of people. You did me. Um, you taught me a lot about the basketball game. Um, I'm still coaching today after 20 years. I'm coaching a high school team now, and I still teach some of the things that you taught me. Um, another thing I want to thank you for is just picking me up. You know, I was a young man, and I hadn't played, had zero but high school experience, and uh, you took a chance to let me on the team, and I appreciate that. I made a lot of lifelong friends through basketball. And anyway, uh, go Coach T and go Lakers. Coach Nichols, hey, sorry I couldn't be there tonight, but I just want to say congratulations on going on the uh, SWAC Wall of Fame. You know, this is an honor that you truly deserve. Um, I think what sets you apart from other coaches is you had such a great player-coach relationship with, with all your players. And I think in turn made uh, your team successful and then made you successful as a coach. Um, you know, looking back in the past, you know, you did so much uh, for us individually, helped us out individually. I know for me personally, um, you know, you helped me uh, finish up my AA degree. You know, that last year there let me be a, a graduate assistant coach so I could finish up school. And then you know I wanted to play uh, two more years, and you helped me get to Concordia, made some phone calls. So I just want to personally thank you for that again. But again, this is an honor that you truly deserve, and I'm so happy for you that you get to go up on the uh, SWAC Wall of Fame. Hey, Coach, uh, I just want to say congratulations. Um, you know I really appreciate everything you've done for me uh, past. 15 years. I can't believe it's been that long, but um, just always being there and being more than a coach, you know, being at my wedding and, and always welcoming uh, you and, and your family, welcoming your home for me and my friends and my family as well. So um, well-deserved, uh, really proud of you. And, and a lot of the stuff that I do now is just attributed to you and, and the success that you've had. So thank you, uh, coach, for being a coach and, and more than that to me. Really appreciate it. Hey, Coach. You're probably surprised to see me. Um, I wanted to give you a little uh, message here tonight just to let you know how much I uh, appreciate everything you've done for me over the years. And I've been thinking about this for quite a while, and I'm glad I've had this opportunity to share this with you. Uh, but I'm really glad to hear about your achievement. You really deserve it. I'm really happy for you. I know you have put a lot of hard work over the years into your job, your commitment and dedication to the college and coaching has taught me a lot of attributes over the years. Even though you only coached me for two years, every day in my life, I think back to that advice you gave me in that short time. It has made me the teacher, the coach, and father that I am today. You're the only coach that I was able to talk to on a personal level throughout my career, and I have made it my goal every year to be that kind of coach that you were with, that you were with me to my players. Because that, in the end, is what I remember from those years that I, you coached me, was all those talks we had in your office, and those have made a huge impact on my life. And so I really try and put that through my coaching now, today. 
You have meant so much to me, and I cannot thank you enough for everything you have done for me. Thank you. Congratulations, Coach. Coach, this is Vodka, and it is 10 o'clock in the morning. I'm drinking one for you. Congratulations. Too bad we couldn't be there. I'd have loved to have been there, celebrated with you and the family. Uh, the two years I was there, running with you guys, I had the time of my life. You opened up the door for me, gave me plenty of opportunity, man, and I appreciate you for that. Thank you for everything you did for me and my two years of playing ball over there. Uh, I hope I didn't make your life as crazy as everybody thought I did for those two years. So, much love. Congratulations. Um, and I, I promised your wife I wouldn't cuss. So, uh, congratulations, asshole. Peace. What's up, coach? First off, let me say congratulations. My name is Deron Perkins. play basketball overseas now. I've been playing professionally for about eight years or something like that. Had a long time. Anyways, it's pretty fitting that I'm making this video right now because we're actually on our way to a game. And I'm 100% sure that I wouldn't be playing in this game if it wasn't for you. It was about 13 years ago when you came to Alaska and somehow convinced my parents that it'd be a good decision for me to come to SWAT. Believe me. I didn't want to come at first. But, you know, you took a chance on a kid from Alaska that you never even saw play. And I think ever since that day, I know that was the best decision I ever made. Or the best decision that was made for me. I learned a lot of things from playing with you, from just being around you, being around your family. And I've always, you know, cherished those memories that I had. You know, one of my favorite quotes that you told me, you know, on the court was, you know, I don't even know if it was your quote, but I'll give you credit for it. You always said, either take one shot or a hundred shots. Doesn't matter, as long as you do everything in your power to help the team win. And that's why I try to take into every game, being a point guard. I just want to thank you for always believing in me. You'll always be my favorite coach hands down. I just want to say, you know, congratulations again. God bless you and your family. P.S. Whenever anybody asks me what college I went to, I always say SWAT. Have to. Thanks for everything. Congratulations again.